So in this first modular studies video, I wanted to focus on using the envelopes to modulate different parameters. Um, and I'll explain in a minute how I'm using the envelopes in this batch. Um, now, what I'm using is a basically a very simple synth batch on the ER301. Like that which is being controlled by the micro ornament in crime here in hemisphere mode and the patch I'm using is on the left side I'm using a clock divider and multiplier and on the right side it's a five-stage sequencer which controls the pitch and then on the disting on the right side I'm using a dual attack decay envelope uh, as two modulation envelopes so let me just tell you real briefly how uh, the patch is set up as I'm sure you can't really tell from the cable mess down here. So the sequencers on, on, organ, on ornament and crime controls pitch and mod envelope modulation. So the mod envelopes are these two because I'm also using for the oscillators within the ER301 I'm using the uh, VCA envelopes within the ER301. Um, so you know the volume of the oscillators is being controlled by the envelopes within 301 and not the modulation envelopes um, but the sequencer does control pitch of the three oscillators and also modulates the modulation envelopes a little bit uh, the two clocks on the ornament in crime the top one controls the oscillator envelope and triggers the modulation envelopes on the testing and then the clock 2 controls the filter frequency uh, and modulates the modulation envelopes a little bit in addition to the sequencer as well so um, then let's talk about the two envelopes so we have two envelopes going out uh, here um, modulation envelope 1 controls the filter frequency as well and the modulation envelope 2 controls a fold parameter within a fold uh, program here on the ER301. So I'll take you through the patch a little bit and we'll add um, elements as we go. So I'm just going to bring up the volume a little bit. So let's start with this. This is a fairly simple synth patch and we'll go in and we'll have a look what else we have. So you'll notice, um, let me just go out a little bit. What I wanted to experiment with is how rhythmical I can get with using just the envelopes and controlling different parameters. For example, uh, the filter uh, cutoff. You'll notice once I turn on the filter how much more movement the patch gets. Um, so let's do that first. So you immediately hear, it gets almost kind of like a delay effect. And then we'll add the actual delay itself. And by using the um, delay in a very specific time, 639 milliseconds, uh, the tempo is 188 BPM by the way. Um, we're getting kind of this harmonic effect almost, which is pretty cool. So let's play with this one a little bit. So you can see how the envelopes and the sequencers control the these parameters here. So it really comes down to the pref personal preference what you're looking for. one and then we have the fold uh, effect as well which kind of adds that a little bit of distortion um, and then of course we can always modulate these things by hand so if I go and modulate the modulation envelope by hand it gets really crazy Thank you. 
basically just uh, modifying the attack and decay with uh, uh, this button here. So there you go, that's the patch. Uh, hope you enjoyed this first video. Um, if you liked it, subscribe to the channel and share with your modular friends.